Welcome to Real Physics. This is a series of short clips about key experiments in physics, and today I'm talking about Heinrich Hertz's discovery of electromagnetic waves in 1886. Well, it was known for a long time. People were suspecting that the propagation of electromagnetic waves was occurring at the speed of light, and Hertz just demonstrated this. He was a young physicist. He had studied with Helmholtz, in Berlin in München and performed the experiments in Karlsruhe and all what he did was showing that there was a sender and a receiver and he proved also reflection. The technology was well known, the induction coil was used to produce that and he needed a very sensitive receiver, it was technically challenging, uh, took several weeks him to prove that and at the end he made one of the most consequential discoveries of all physics. If you think about modern civilization with radio waves and telecommunication and TV and mobile phones and so on and satellite communication. And the point to make here, I think, is that it was not that he was trying to invent all these things. It was just curiosity for the laws of nature that uh, drove his uh, interest and yeah this is one point and the other point i have uh, sometimes mentioned from a methodological point of view it was very important to eliminate one constant of nature out of this equation one over c squared equals epsilon naught mu naught and uh, this reduces the number of fundamental constants from p to two and uh, well rightly he said that he had a fulfilled life he knew that he had to die early at the age of 36. I think that might be all what you can expect from life. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in fundamental questions of physics, subscribe to this channel.